Two people arrested in connection with a shooting on the campus of Alabama A&M University last month are scheduled to appear in court tomorrow. Authorities say back in August, a shooting took place outside a multi-use building on campus. Two men were arrested and charged with assault after the incident, which caused disruption on the HBCU's campus. News 19 investigative reporter Dallas Parker joining us now in the studio with the very latest on those cases. Dallas. That's right. Both 23-year-old Willie Nance and 22-year-old Christopher Thomas are scheduled to appear in court tomorrow. Both men were charged with assault in the first degree in August following a shootout on campus. Now, according to to court records. Nance is scheduled for a preliminary hearing at 930 tomorrow morning and Nance's case will go before Madison County District Judge Linda Coates. The second man charged in the case, Thomas, is scheduled to, uh, for a felon, felon examination at 1030 tomorrow morning. Thomas's case is before Madison County District Judge Don Rosardi. Now authorities say Nance and Thomas started shooting at one another outside of the night complex on Alabama A&M University's campus. Students who witnessed the incident tell us the two men got into a fight inside of the cafeteria and the fight moved outside where the gunshots were fired. Officials on the scene told News 19 both men were injured in that shooting. Of course, we plan to have a reporter in court tomorrow to bring you the latest on these cases. You can be sure to find the latest on those matters here on air on WHNT.com and our News 19 app. Now, I should add today, there was also a reported incident of someone with a gun on the school's campus. However, an hour after the report, the school issued an all clear stating that there was, quote, no threat in the area. Now, at this time, it's not clear whether a person was taken into custody at that time or if the report was actually false.